I have recently decided that I really want to try out these face masks from Kmart. They're only like $3 each and you never know, they might be good. I know that the one last time was a lot better than this one. It's aloe vera and cucumber and it feels pretty much identical to aloe vera gel. It might make my skin feel better afterwards though, so I'll let you guys know. But the experience of putting it on is just very sticky and I like being able to see it. It's cool. I know this reason is mostly my fault because I could have avoided it, but I accidentally got the taste of it in my mouth and I hate the taste of it so, so much. I think it just reminds me of aloe vera a lot and every time I have aloe vera on my face usually I'm usually in pain and stuff so it's not a good association. It does make my skin feel pretty soft but nothing special like most face masks do. It does still feel pretty dry and I guess it does feel soothed but it's not the best. <laughs> Your dead organs are awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Just the book, maybe not like Wilmot's or something. Lumos? Lumos? Just book thing of Lumos. <laughs> okay, yeah. Lumos is nothing. You're practicing a beam that is like three times as wide as the ones that they have at the left deck. So pretty. Yeah, yeah. Mm. <laughs> right now we are at Listerfield Park which is about 40 minutes away from our house which is weird because it looks like completely different. It's crazy how you don't even have to drive that far for it to be different. Run an adventure. <laughs> like looks so small because I'm closer to the camera. We're doing like a five kilometer walk while dad does his ride. That's how we're spending Father's Day and dad's buying himself a Father's Day present because I don't know what to get him. I'm not a good daughter. Bad daughter. <laughs> I know but he buys everything if he wants it. He's getting himself some stuff from Lululemon. I think the clothing sport brands and we're also going to Hendrix so that means we're gonna get a really nice lunch so I'm excited yay hey, these ones don't have blue chests <laughs> and they don't have orange beaks <laughs> hey guys these idiot fools think they're at the beach this ain't a beach I just turned around to see them. Oh, oh, he's huge. Holy crap, it's massive. He's taller than us. He is, he's taller than me. Oh, oh, I've never seen a kangaroo in the wild. His tail could probably knock me out. Yeah, it could. You can see a wallaby over there. Oh, you cutie. <laughs> Oh, Wait, good luck charms. Yeah, I've seen like nine. <laughs> oh, they're so close. Where are they? I don't know. Why can't we see them? Are they underwater? They're only on the edges. Why can't we see them? Look for bubbles. They all stop. Yeah, because I can see. They know we're here. We just saw like ten in this whole trip. Well, there's one running towards me. It's two running towards me. Eleven, twelve. Twelve sightings. Oh. Look at mum waving at them. <laughs> there is a pack in the distance. That's 14 now. This is like my first cliche Australian vlog ever. God, they look funny when they um don't jump and they're just crawling. Their body's so out of proportion. <laughs> Today, which is the 6th of September, we saw 16 kangaroos. So we're gonna try to beat the record in future reference. What? That doesn't even make any sense. What am I saying? Yeah. Blake got a chicken and mushroom pie, and I got a melting moment because I love these, but I don't get to have them too much. <laughs> juicy. Juicy, juicy. This one is pretty good, it took Dad a while though. Even though you should have understood it the most because it's a Dad's Day special. This one's just lame. I'm choosing between this one and this one. But it has avocado and toast in it so I might as well get that one.
the awkward moment where Blake just went and left for a bike ride and it just started pouring. Look at it. He's barely wearing anything anyway. He told me that he was going to be really cold. I don't feel like vlogging. Okay. Wait. Oh. <laughs> Fooled you. Haha. <laughs> will be so hard. You look a fool now. Mink is a fool. Tell the story of Mink. He's an asshole of a human. She ain't a human, y'all. Well, she'd be an asshole. Do you like my outfit? I just realized my shoes actually match. Every freaking morning, I get woken up at like 7 o'clock. She just likes to slam her fucking head into a door and bark <laughs> at everything. I haven't had a full night's sleep in months. That's not true, but <laughs> pissed off. <laughs> Every time she like slams her head into a door and barks the shit, your mom lets her out. So she's like, ooh, if I slam my head into this fucking door <laughs> so fucking loudly, I'll get let out. Let's just do it again. 